Hey guys, Josh is Moore here from SamuraiBlogger.com. Uh, I just wanted to put together a quick video and talk to you a little bit about proper link building for effective SEO in today's environment. Uh, because some of you may or may not know that uh, Google has been making a lot of changes with their Panda update and their Penguin update to show better results for, for their users. So things that used to work in the past prior to the Panda and the Penguin update do not work in today's environment. So I just want to quickly go into what those things are uh, so that you can identify the best SEO company to hire for your website. Uh, now, if you would like for us to have a look at your website and evaluate it and see how we can help you uh, get higher in the search engines, then you can just click on the link that's going to be right below this video and we'll be more than happy to talk to you and take a look at your site and your services and see how we can help you. Uh, so I just want to go ahead and jump into this really quick. Now, when it comes to effective SEO link building, uh, one of the most important things you want to uh, think about is getting links from sites that have good page rank. Now, for those of you that don't know what page rank is, uh, this is basically uh, Google's rating system for how much trust they have in a website. And their page rank ratings go from zero uh, to 10. 10 being the worst, zero being the best. So if you go to websites like Facebook or YouTube, uh, those sites have a lot of authority, have a lot of trust in Google. So their page rank is anywhere from nine to 10, okay? And if you are looking at uh, more of a spammy website that doesn't provide good content, that doesn't have good site structure, and it's just an overall crappy website, uh, it's more likely that that site has a page rank of zero. Uh, so when it comes to getting other sites to link to yours, you want to make sure that you're getting sites that have good page rank. Now, not all of, not all the, the, the sites that are linking to yours are going to have good page rank, but you do want to have some in there that have a good page rank, like page rank two, page rank three, page rank four, uh, page rank you know anything above a page rank zero is is good okay and um, not all links are valued equally okay a link from a page rank eight uh, website is a hundred times more powerful than a page rank one website so you want to keep that in mind when you're speaking to an SEO uh, link building company that you want to make sure that they will provide you some kind of high page rank backlinks for your website Okay. Uh, number two is relevancy. Okay. You want to make sure that you're getting links from relevant places. Okay. If your website is about real estate, you want to make sure you're getting links from other business, finance, real estate websites. Okay. Now, of course, not all your links are going to be from relevant sites, uh, but you want to have a good majority of them uh, be from those sites that are in the same industry or the same niche as you are, okay? Uh, the, the third thing is IP diversity, okay? You want to make sure that you're getting links from a bunch of different sites hosted on different hosting accounts, okay? So each website out there online is hosted and has their own unique IP address, okay? So the more uh, sites that link to you that have different IP addresses, the more natural and the better that looks to Google uh, when it comes to your site getting those links. Uh, so you do want to make sure that you're getting different IP uh, diversity uh, because if a hundred websites link to yours and all of those 100 websites are on the same IP address, uh, you can bet your, your bottom dollar that Google is going to see something fishy with that because all of those sites are on the same IP address. Okay, so I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that that's making sense for you. Uh, and if any of this is, uh, is, is not really making sense, just leave me a comment below or send me a private message or just click the link that's going to be below this video and we can you know, connect more and I can talk to you, uh, talk to you about this a little bit more. Uh, now, the fourth thing is velocity. Okay, there's a lot of companies out there that offer one-off services. 
okay we'll send you 2,000 links for $25 or we'll send you you know 10,000 links for $50 in a matter of days and some of you may think that that's a good thing uh, but in essence it's really not those kind of one-off services don't work anymore okay when it comes to effective SEO link building when it comes to long term okay we're thinking long term here you want all of your SEO to be able to stick and and be there in the long run okay and all of these one-off services are they may give you a small boost at the beginning uh, but if you don't maintain that velocity uh, and continue to build links then all of that one-off service juice is going to fade off okay so you want to first establish and maintain a good velocity when it comes to building links okay so the company that you're looking for or the company that you're going to be talking to you want to make sure they mention that they're going to maintain a good velocity of uh, link building that's going to be coming to your site okay because uh, let's just imagine that your website gets 10,000 links in a matter of uh, two weeks to one month and then the next month they get just two links and then the month after that they get another 10,000 links and then the month the next two or three months there's no links so if you see that that's going to look very suspicious to Google because you're not maintaining a steady velocity of links being built so it doesn't really look like your site is growing in popularity okay uh, and the last thing is anchor text diversity okay and this is something that uh, penguin really targeted the penguin update because uh, if you were too aggressive in your anchor text backlinks uh, then uh, it, it is a good chance that you got hurt by the penguin update so in today's environment you want to make sure that you're getting a good diversity of anchor text uh, from the links that are being built to your site so you want to make sure you include some click here links uh, some raw URL links and even some brand name links and keep the anchor text exact match of the keyword you're targeting uh, to a minimum you want to keep it under 30 percent okay uh, and then include the rest of them to be your brand name or the raw URL or even some of click here or read more here things like that you you definitely want to have a good diversity of anchor text all right and uh, right now I just want to show you a quick image of what your link building should look like uh, so down here is your website all right and in today's environment you want to make sure you're getting only the best kind of links pointing directly to your site okay so here I'm talking about a, 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 this is gonna be your first tier of links alright and the links the links that are pointing directly to your site should be only the the best kind of links alright and and these are links like press releases like uh, high authority web 2.0 sites like hub pages squidoo things like that uh, guest blogging all right you want to make sure that you're able to go out there and identify some some blogs in your niche where you can post articles linking to your site uh, infographics all right infographics are a great inexpensive way to really get information out there and also get information syndicated because people love to pass on infographics uh, video sharing sites okay if you're not using uh, video sharing sites like YouTube and Vimeo uh, to have your presence out there you definitely want to get on board that as well PDF syndication you can easily turn your videos uh, just like the one that you're watching now I can easily turn this into a uh, PDF and syndicate it to PDF sites like uh, SlideShare and, and different uh, websites like that social networks all right uh, you want to make sure that you're on uh, uh, the major social networks out there and social network sites like Pinterest um, Tumblr um, you know and just the, the different social networks out there that uh, that are uh, of good page rank and good authority in Google's eyes and the last thing is social media okay if you not if you are not on social media sites uh, Facebook Twitter um, um, you know you even Instagram those different kind of uh, social media sites you want to make sure that you're on there Google Plus okay uh, social media and social signals is a big part of the effective SEO uh, in 2012 and moving forward okay you want to make sure that 
uh, Google sees that your customers, your clients, your audience is sharing your information on their social media networks. Okay, and from there, once you have your first tier links built, uh, again, these are going to be the most effective and most uh, most highly uh, sites with the most authority linking to yours. Then you want to build a second tier of links to your first tier of links, so to help them get uh, indexed and to help them give an extra boost to your links. Uh, so before. Uh, what used to work was that every kind of link would be sent directly to your site. All right, but now you want to build somewhat of a buffer so that uh, you want to have the first, uh, the most powerful kind of links linking to your site, and then the less powerful links uh, linking through your buffer sites. Uh, so this is uh, some of the most effective SEO link building strategies that is going to help you to really climb the search engines and really dominate in your niche. Uh, so these are just a few things that you want to go ahead and keep in mind when it comes to picking a uh, the best SEO company for you and for your business. Uh, and again, if you want us to look into your site and uh, evaluate it and see how we can help you, just click on the link that's going to be right below this video and we'll be more than happy to speak to you and see how we can form a plan of action uh, just like the one that I discussed in this video to help you rank in your in the search engines and uh, if you have any questions or something wasn't really clear in this video i'll be more than happy to speak to you a little more and answer any questions uh, so just click the link that's going to be right below this video